Welcome to today's video. Uh, it's been a while since I've last uploaded, so excited to be back. Uh, Going to be doing a full day of eating for you guys today. Um, yeah, always been wanting to do one of these, and I think put you on some game. But yeah, going to be doing about three meals. I don't think I'm going to track my macros like that, but I'll put them down for you guys for, for all the meals. But yeah, usually I eat around three meals. If I eat more than that, I really can't. So, But yeah, three meals. Maybe some snacking. I uh, got a big sweet tooth, but I think I'm going to be trying to do maybe one new recipe that I saw on social media, like a macro friendly, like sweet recipe. But yeah, we're going to try that out. Uh, but yeah, gonna, let's get into it. Welcome back for meal number one. We're going to be doing my coffee, my egg scramble that people rave about, <laughs> um, and then some toast. So yeah, it's going to be breakfast. I'm going to put it together. I uh, just wanted to show you guys. This is the breakfast sausage I use. Put a screenshot over there. Um, I get it from Trader Joe's. Has a really good protein to fat ratio, two to one actually. So I think for two links, it's like four and a half fat, nine grams of protein. So that's really good for sausage. Usually they're more fatty. And this honestly tastes really good. Pick that up at Trader Joe's. Yeah, it's really solid. But yeah, I'm gonna put whip together this breakfast and then show you the final product. Good morning. Oh yeah. What's that? Ow. Good morning. Good morning, Babas. Good morning. Good morning, Babas. You just got a haircut? <laughs> yeah. Say hi. All right, so this is breakfast. Got my egg scramble. Diced up my chicken sausage. Do a little bit of light cheese on there. Here's my toast. Uh, let me show the bread that I'm using. So this is the bread I use. I use three slices of this. Macros are for two slices, one fat, 18 carb, five protein. Probably the best macros you're going to find for bread. But I got toast and I got some, I can't believe it's butter, the white version. Butter on that. And that's my coffee. And this is breakfast. I'll put the macros uh, on the screen as well. All right. For the next part of the video, I'm going to be going through a new recipe that I just saw on Instagram and TikTok, honestly. Uh, the guy's name is at the flexible dieting lifestyle FDL uh, put his, you know, his handle or whatever right here. But this guy's he's, I guess classifies as like a macro magician or whatever, but he, he makes them like really good um, looking recipes. I don't know if they taste good, but the couple that I've had have been pretty fire, but uh, this one's going to be for protein donut holes. I don't know. I just saw it recently. Shit look good. I haven't had donuts in a while. I've got a big sweet tooth. The macros on them look crazy. They look good. So, we can go ahead and try it out. Yeah, and uh, along with that, I'll probably make like a side salad or something. So I'll show you guys that too. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and whip this recipe together. Um, got all the stuff right there. Got all the ingredients. So went went to the grocery store, got it. Uh, had to make some substitutions. So hopefully I don't fuck the recipe up. But yeah, go ahead. going to go ahead and whip that up. And hopefully I don't fuck it up. All right, we made them. They look pretty good. Uh, got the like the little glaze on it too. So go ahead and give you guys a live taste test. Uh, so I let these sit, made my substitutions and stuff, but we find a good one. This is what it looks like. Not too bad. That's lighting good. Yeah. A little dry, maybe I overcooked it, but not bad. I think I made them too big too. Let me get another one. Definitely overcooked it. Damn me. <clears throat> that shit dry as fuck. But yeah, a little dry. But not bad. I mean, honestly, when you put icing on it, definitely not as like airy as regular donut holes. But I would definitely have to tweak it again and make the balls a little bit smaller and don't cook it too much. But it wasn't bad, but I don't know. I'll give it like six and a half. This batch, ooh, not six and a half, six out of ten. Yeah, if I maybe do it again, I could see the potential. There's potential. But yeah, this batch that I made, I don't know if I eat it again, but yeah, not too bad. But now I'm going to make a salad. Uh, 
because I'm just not going to eat donut holes. So I'm going to make my salad. I'll put that together and show you what it looks like. All right. Got my little salad. Tell me that she do. Hey, Bubba. Hey. You want that? I uh, got my little salad. It's just like a spring mix and spinach, some rotisserie chicken, and some cheese. So the chicken I get, uh, I actually bought the rotisserie chicken from Costco and just kind of pulled, took out all the breast meat. Uh, and just kind of put it together in some Tupperware. So this is about four and a half ounces of that breast meat. It's okay. But then the dressing, the secret sauce, it's this green goddess dressing, as I showed in an earlier video. But what I do, I've elevated my game now. So what I do with that, so I put about two servings of that. And if you haven't, oh, let me get the, if you haven't gone to Trader Joe's yet, get this hot and sweet jalapenos and use this brine. So use a little bit of this brine. Mix it up with that dressing. Game changer. That's just good as fuck. But yeah, I'm going to eat this salad. As you can see, I've had some of the donut holes. They grow on you, but still 6 out of 10. Uh, maybe less, but honestly, it's sweet. It's good enough. Um, but yeah, going to eat this. And yeah. On the way to the, or the driving range. I go to the driving range. Had some of these Sour Patch Kids peach flavor. Never had these before. Honestly, on the scale of Sour Patch Kids, the extremes and the originals are much better. I um, wanted to try it out. I've been on a little peach kick lately, but they're not bad. This is what they look like. Like little circular gummies. They're okay. Give it like a cool seven. Not too sour. Uh, more on the sweeter side, but if you focus Sour Patch Kids and you're interested, uh, had about a serving and a half of these, so about 30, 35 carb. So just a little snack for the driving range. Now about to go hit some golf balls. All right, we're back here with my dinner. Uh, had some chicken already air fried uh, from a couple nights ago. Seasoned it with the fajita seasoning, or fajita seasoning like the Mexican seasoning. Uh, fajita seasoning, like garlic salt, lime juice, black pepper, a little bit of onion powder in there air fried it, chopped it up, made it like kind of like taco meat. So I got that. And then I got these like 25 cal uh, mission. The brand name is Mission Tortillas. They're like street taco tortillas. Uh, very low calorie for four of them. You get 20 carbs. What's the math per tortilla, guys? That's right. You guys are all smart. Five carbs per tortilla. So you can't really beat those macros. So I got six of them things right here. Bam. As you can see. And that was good as fuck. Bam, thumbnail. Uh, but yeah, on three of them, I got a little bit of salsa roja. I took Spanish guys, Spanish three. And then on the other three, I got a green dragon sauce from Trader Joe's. So that one's real fire. Got a little bit of lime juice on all of them. A little bit of light Mexican cheese. These tacos about to fucking hit. Got six of them. About to throw them down. And then I got spicy nacho Doritos on the side. Uh, just to kind of complement it. Uh, so yeah, this is dinner. It should fill me up a little bit. I'm going to chug it with some, uh, or wash it down with some water. I got my hydro and then, yeah, that's going to be dinner and watch some Netflix and watch some new girl. Probably new girl is probably one of the funniest shows out. Um, and then, uh, we're going to wrap it up with dinner or, stupid, bro. We're going to wrap it up with uh, dessert. Always gotta, I always have to end any meal or my night off. Uh, with the dessert. So I'll show you what I'm eating for dessert. So tune in. I fucked that up. But yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> Alright, it's dessert time. And this is the moment you guys have been with. Damn, this pack is empty. Is this the same pack? It's been a little light. But we got the Brookie Oreos. Probably top two, top three Oreo flavor I've had. The only one that was better was a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. They, they don't make that anymore, but Get two of these bad boys, and that's dessert. Always got to end the night off with something sweet. Ain't that right, Anary? Yeah. <laughs> it's not on you, but I just want to. <laughs> she, she's too shy. She'll, she'll, be, she'll make her appearance soon. Um, but, yeah, that's dessert, and that's going to wrap up the full day of eating. I'll put the total macros on the screen. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this one, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.